All right, and we're recording. Hey gang, Andy here, coming at you, Pook, with another uh, car video, or car vlog, rather. And uh, today I'm gonna be taking you guys to the town where I grew up at, uh, Coldwater, Ohio. And uh, there's not a whole lot, you know, to say about, about it. It's just a, a real small town, but uh, it holds a lot of uh, memories and stuff like that for me. And uh, yeah, so I thought I'd take you on a little tour here. So here we go. And there's a cop car now. I guess they, that's what they look like now. Huh. Yeah, I haven't been back in the States for uh, that long to, yeah. Anyways, I'd, no, I lost my train of thought. But anyway, um, yeah, this is the town where I grew up at. I moved out to Salina when I was in fifth grade and then just kind of went and did my own thing from there. But uh, before then, I lived out here. You know, kind of back and forth between here and Michigan. So, yeah, this place holds a near and dear place to my heart. Stuff like that. You know, it's full of a lot of good memories, a lot of bad memories too, but it's also good there. And on the left, you can see Dairyland, which is one of the best places to get ice cream at here in uh, cold water. At least it was when I grew up. I don't know if it's a shithole now, but <laughs> it was good when I was growing up. So, yeah. Then we'll buzz by the, uh, the park here. And, uh, oh, by the way, on the left, is the entrance to the uh, bike path that connects Coldwater to Salina. So a lot of times I would go and uh, just take a little trip out there just for something to do, get a little exercise and all that stuff. So yeah. Then on the, le on the left again was uh, all the schools for Coldwater. So they're all kind of bunched together really from K to uh, 12. So, uh, like one side is elementary and then junior high and then high school. So, that's kind of how they do that. And up here is Memorial Park, which is where um, my parents and I would come out and, you know, we'd go out, play with the dog, that kind of stuff. And, uh, yeah, this is when I was a real little kid, I'd come out here. Then, obviously, you know, we'd go to the pool and stuff too. But uh, yeah, a lot of final limb pickup. What? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I don't know what that was about, but uh, yeah, you know, a lot of memories uh, growing up here. So I'm just kind of, kind of taking it all in. So if I'm not as, uh, you know, active in talking to you guys as I normally am, I apologize. I'm just, just kind of taking it in right now all the uh, scenery and stuff, especially with the with the fall colors and everything, you know, it's very, um, just a beautiful time to go, you know, cruising around, you know, these kinds of places. So, yeah. Yeah, I remember my folks and I coming out here and, and play on the swings and stuff like that. It was a lot of fun. So uh, let's go a little bit more into town. First I'll show you the, uh, the house where I grew up at, and then I'll show you the, uh, the main stretch of cold water. And like I said, you know, there's not a whole lot to this town. It's a very small town, so uh, you know, don't expect like big skyscrapers or anything like that, obviously, but uh, yeah. Get up here and uh, yeah, this is the. Uh, geez, I believe this is the uh, third or fourth time I tried recording this video because the uh, the SD card on my GoPro is kind of acting up right now. So um, I don't know why it does that. It's, it's very strange. Might have to end up formatting it just to. You know, <laughs> hopefully I'll fix it up, but uh, we'll see. We'll see. So anyway, yeah, I've kind of buzzed through cold water here like three times already. 
you know, trying to make this video and like, it wouldn't make the beep so I wouldn't know if, uh, if it was recording or not. So I just kind of assumed it was. And then I like get through my whole friggin' spiel and I look and I'm like ready to stop the thing and it's like, oh, it's starting up. Like, hey, what? <laughs> so, yeah. Little technical difficulties with this video, but that's okay. That's okay. Hopefully now it's working. I can see the little timer ticking off because I'm using the GoPro app as well. So um, yeah, I'm just keeping an eye on it to make sure that uh, everything's going off as it should. So yeah, right up here, I'll take you guys to the house where I grew up at. Then we'll buzz by the main stretch here. So there's a house on the, uh, the left that uh, I don't know if it still is, but back in the day it was owned by this guy named Indian George. And he owned like the biggest dog I've ever seen. It was an Alaskan Malamute. And uh, it was the biggest dog I've ever seen. So I just thought it was pretty crazy. But anyway, yeah, this is, uh, this is the neighborhood where I grew up at. It's pretty crazy. So West Walnut up here. <laughs> So, um, the house where I grew up at is owned by, um, different people now. So, um, it's really weird to see, uh, just other stuff in the driveway now. So, the house with all the pumpkins and stuff. Yeah, that was the house where I grew up at. It's just so strange. And then, uh, I'll take you guys on the, the back, the back end of it too, just cause it's, it's a very big house. And I know it's kind of stalkerish, but you know, this will be the last pass, I promise. So, yeah. They're probably wondering, what, what the hell is that guy doing back here again? <laughs> it's whatever. I don't care. I don't, I don't come out this way that often, so it's, it's whatever. Yeah. You know, so, yeah, this is, you know, the area where I grew up at. Uh, yeah. And this is the little back end here. It's, they put a garage in here now. It's kind of strange. But, you know. Yeah, it's just fucking crazy now, man. All right. I just remember having, you know, super so soaker wars with uh, my friends and stuff out here when I was really, really young. And uh, yeah, it was, it was a lot of fun, I'm not gonna lie. Ah, but such is life. All right, so now I'm gonna take you on the uh, the main stretch of cold water here. So, like I said, not much to do. But uh, on the left is the uh, the fire, or the EMS slash fire department sort of outpost. And uh, every Saturday at noon, they used to test the uh, the emergency alarms. And uh, that was always kind of fun. I don't know if they still do it or not. But yeah, there's the library. And then over here on the left, this place called the Mr. Shop. There was a place right next to it, which I guess they bought out, that um, used to be a video rental place. And uh, my mom still held the record for most uh, rented videos because my brother and I would just get so many video games and stuff. And then now on the left is a place, where, where we're at right now, is a place called Rice Bowl. And that used to be, um, my, that was my last job before I joined the U.S. Navy. And now on the left is uh, the church, which was one of my um, very first Life in Video episodes. Yeah, sorry for the whole the whole barrage of stuff it's just there's a whole lot of things going on in a short little span so i apologize for the barrage but anyway yeah so i have a lot of history here man and i remember biking up and down these roads and everything like that when i was younger and even when i came back uh, shortly after i got kicked out of urbana university back in 2007 almost almost a decade ago now um, I just remember going down these streets and uh, just, you know, thinking about stuff, thinking about life, thinking about 
whatever. Yeah. And then on the on the left is the uh, grocery stores and stuff like that. And then on the right is the cemetery out here where uh, where my dad's buried and my grandparents as well. So yeah, fun stuff, fun stuff. So that was pretty much it for uh, Coldwater, Ohio. Like I said, not a whole lot to it, but it holds a special place in my heart just because I grew up there and, uh, you know, stuff like that. So with that said, this is the Andy Son. Signing out for now. Thanking you guys for uh, tuning into this video and for watching my other stuff. Also want to thank you guys for liking with the thumbs, commenting, subscribing, send a few friends to the party. And hey, as always, we'll see you next time. Catch you later, guys. Bye.